Someone asked me last week, why do I bother sticking up for kids and confronting adults when toxic behavior is happening right in front of me? They asked me if I really thought that it made a difference, considering that they're only with me for a few minutes, and then the same behavior will likely resume once they leave. Being an extremely neurodivergent kid in the 80s and 90s, I dealt with my fair share of toxic and abusive situations, mostly because the adults in my life didn't understand me or my behavior. My coping mechanism was to just go somewhere else in my head, find some happy moment to hang on to until it was over. I know that I'm not going to be able to change an adult's behavior in the five or 10 minutes that they spend with me. But what I can do is give that kid a moment to hold on to. A moment that an adult stuck up for them and validated that what was happening to them was wrong. And yes, it has been brought up to me that I could in fact end up making it worse for the child and they will get in trouble anyways as soon as they leave. In my experience, adults that exhibit this behavior on a regular basis don't need a reason. They might use me as an excuse this time, but even if I keep quiet, they will most likely find another reason to exhibit this same behavior at a later time. At least in this situation, that child knows that an adult stood up for them and was on their side, which would have been huge for a kid like me. So yeah, I say something. I let those kids know that I'm on their side and their feelings are valid. I give them a moment to hang on to.